I'm just going to take it off and then turn and look. <laughs> oh, so funny, I haven't even looked yet. <laughs> Why is it funny? You know that bit in The Simpsons where Homer builds a barbecue? <laughs> One fine looking barbecue pit. Why doesn't mine look like that? Ah! Now have a look. <laughs> <laughs> Yay. <laughs> what a nice addition to our 18th century <laughs> ancient water source. <laughs> now we fix it. <laughs> oh, how? What are you doing? Just covering over this drain with tape so that we don't um, get muck down the drain and concrete it shut before we start, <laughs> which would be unfortunate. I think that's the least of our worries, honestly. We we're trying to drain this using a hose. Surely that can't go wrong. No. <laughs> I might move away from this hose reel in a sec. That'll go there. He's turning on the tap. You have to wait for water to come out that end. What's this space to do? Right, now I turn off the tap over here. Should water come out of that end? Yeah, if it stops, it hasn't worked. If it doesn't stop, it has worked. Great. <laughs> so we don't know yet <laughs> <laughs> here we go yeah top quality broadcasting the thing is there's a lot of hose reels so it would take a lot of time for the water in the hose reel to fall out of the hose even if it wasn't going to work we can go up here to see if it's worked because we'll see the level dropping very ah. very slowly yeah it has worked because the look here, the water's not coming out. And that's oh, yeah. what we wanted to prevent. And there you have it, a siphon pump. No electricity or fossil fuels involved. No it's skill just needed. No skill <laughs> possible. <laughs> <laughs> it's just sucking out the water for free. Um, so there we go. Right, let's get mixing uh, lime mortar. Look at us using scales to weigh things out. Uh, we're wearing masks this time because this stuff is toxic. We're mixing it up. Um, it's NHL5 hydraulic lime, which is natural hydraulic lime as opposed to supernatural. Um, let's mix it up. Um, okay, so this is well mixed now. Uh, so the plan is to just sort of pour it over here and um, <laughs> profit. <laughs> oh dear. I think maybe you should shovel a few bits yeah. out first so that you don't just lose the whole lot. Oh, why isn't the wheel cooperating? Oh, oh. Jesus. That's no. no, oh. Oh lord. So to get, it, get the line to stick to the rock, you're supposed to give it a little water first so that it binds. That That's little area is wet do. anyway, to be honest. Behold, 
the grey. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Sorry about the garden chair, it's to keep the hose from touching the grey. <laughs> <laughs> Yes, uh, so it's down, it's not very exactly level, <laughs> but such. It's there and it's flush with the drain. Yep. Um, there's a sort of gradient there, so hopefully water will go that way. <laughs> <laughs> sort of gradient. Should we look at that gradient no, in more let's detail? Not too, let's not look too closely, okay. actually. <laughs> okay, we won't, look, we won't look at the gradient <laughs> this time. Uh, but tomorrow, if it's dry enough, um, or the day after, I'll brush it down with a wire brush just to get the um, the level a bit nicer and get rid of the reveal some of the stones that are in there covered up okay it looks better than it did I didn't know that this was stage two <laughs> yes it looks better than it did. I thought that the yeah the weird sort of higgledy piggledy stone disaster was the finished project and I was like what the poop <laughs> is this <laughs> what have you done <laughs> but yeah it is very gray but we'll see how it is after some brushing okay it's been about a week since we did the um, lime mortaring at the front of the water source and it's only just enough to resist my uh, the pad of my finger pressing into it um, stuff dries really really slowly sets sorry really really slowly um, which makes it easy to work with but also not so great if it's going to get really cold um, which is happening um, to us let's go and have a look at what we ended up with so as you can see it's nice and gray <laughs> um, and the cats have very kindly covered it with little tiny kitty muddy footprints <laughs> despite our best efforts with this tarp over here to cover it up and protect it. Thank you cats. Oh and here comes one now. Is this your doing? Hmm? Not very helpful are you? No. Um, so the first job is just to clean it up so that I can brush it with a wire brush before it sets too much. Thank you, cat. That's how they roll. Yes, you are very helpful, aren't you? Very helpful. It's going to resist me standing on it. No. This is just not working at all, is it? What I'm going to do now is um, just brush it um, a little bit to get the, um, the big lumps out and to have a smooth surface, hopefully. Never done this before, let's see how it goes. Okay, not well is the answer. It's extremely not set enough, I don't think, for this job because it's just coming off immediately. Hmm. taking up too much. We're gonna to have to wait a while I think. Gonna to have to wait a bit for this to set a bit more I think. It's taking up too much with the brush, big lumps are coming off. It's not really supposed to do that. Oh well, <laughs> probably see you in a couple of weeks. <laughs> 